Deep in the Horn of Africa, amidst scorching deserts and ancient salt flats, lies a region like no other on Earth. This is a place where the ground beneath us is alive, constantly shifting and changing, showcasing the dynamic nature of our planet. Welcome to the Afar Triangle, a land sculpted by unimaginable forces, where three tectonic plates are pulling apart, tearing the African continent apart. The African, Arabian, and Somali plates converge here, creating a geological marvel that is both awe-inspiring and humbling. This is a place of extremes, with blistering heat, volcanic fury, and stark otherworldly beauty. The landscape is dotted with volcanic cones, lava fields, and salt flats that stretch endlessly, creating a surreal and almost alien environment. Here, in this remote corner of Ethiopia, the Earth's crust is being stretched thin, like dough under a baker's hand. The ground is constantly moving, with new fissures and cracks appearing regularly, a visible reminder of the immense forces at work beneath the surface. Volcanoes erupt, spewing molten rock and ash into the sky, while vast fissures crack open in the earth, swallowing entire landscapes in an instant. The power of these eruptions is both terrifying and mesmerizing, a stark reminder of the raw energy that lies beneath our feet. Yet, amidst this seemingly inhospitable terrain, life endures. Sparse vegetation clings to the rocky soil, and hardy wildlife has adapted to the harsh conditions, finding ways to survive in this extreme environment. The nomadic Afar people, with their ancient traditions and remarkable resilience, call this land home. They have lived here for centuries, their lives shaped by the rhythms of the earth and the challenges of the environment. They have learned to survive in one of the hottest and driest places on the planet, their lives intimately intertwined with the rhythms of the earth. Their knowledge of the land and its resources is unparalleled, allowing them to thrive where others might perish. The Afar region is not merely a geological curiosity, it is a living laboratory, offering scientists an unparalleled opportunity to witness the forces that shape our planet. Researchers from around the world come here to study the tectonic activity, volcanic eruptions, and unique geological formations, gaining insights that can help us understand the Earth's past and future. The Afar Triangle is a place where we can see the birth of an ocean, where the very map of the world is being redrawn. As the tectonic plates continue to pull apart, a new ocean basin is forming, a process that will eventually lead to the creation of a new sea, changing the geography of the region forever. It is a stark reminder of the immense power of nature and the fragility of our own existence in the face of such awesome forces. The Afar Triangle is a place of wonder and danger, a testament to the ever-changing nature of our planet and the incredible forces that shape it. Here, we are reminded of our place in the world and the delicate balance that allows life to flourish amidst such powerful natural phenomena. The Afar Triangle derives its name from the Afar people, who have braved its harsh conditions for thousands of years. These resilient individuals have adapted to one of the planet's most extreme environments, demonstrating remarkable endurance and ingenuity. Their traditional attire, often vibrant and intricately designed, contrasts sharply with the stark landscape they inhabit. The Afar people have developed unique survival strategies, passing down their knowledge and skills through generations. This is a land of stark contrasts, where shimmering salt flats bake under an unyielding sun, creating a blindingly white expanse that stretches endlessly. These salt flats are remnants of ancient lakes that have long since evaporated, leaving behind vast salt deposits. The heat waves rising from the ground create a mirage-like effect, making the horizon appear to waver and dance. This harsh environment tests the limits of human endurance and creativity. Volcanic craters scar the landscape like open wounds, a testament to the region's violent geological history. Volcanic eruptions have shaped and reshaped the land over millennia, and some craters remain active. These jagged edges and deep chasms create a dramatic and otherworldly landscape that is both awe-inspiring and intimidating. The Danakil Depression, plunging 100 meters below sea level, is one of the hottest and driest places on Earth. Temperatures can soar above 50 degrees Celsius, making it one of the most inhospitable places for human habitation. Despite these extreme conditions, the Danakil Depression hosts a unique and diverse ecosystem with species adapted to survive in this harsh environment. 
the landscape is a mosaic of salt flats, volcanic craters, and mineral deposits, creating a surreal and otherworldly scene. Beneath the scorching sun lies a treasure trove of minerals. The region is rich in potash, sulfur, and salt, which have been mined for centuries. These minerals are valuable resources and contribute to the vibrant and colorful landscape of the Danakil Depression. The mineral deposits glisten in the sunlight, creating a dazzling display of colors that contrast sharply with the barren desert surroundings. Salt, a precious commodity in this unforgiving environment, is mined from vast salt pans, remnants of an ancient lake that once filled this depression. The process of mining salt is labor-intensive and requires great skill and endurance. Workers use traditional methods to extract the salt, cutting it into large blocks and transporting it by camel caravans. This ancient practice has been passed down through generations and remains an important part of the local economy and culture. Volcanic activity has shaped the landscape, creating a tapestry of colors, sulfurous yellows, rusty reds, and the deep black of basalt rock. These vibrant hues result from the various minerals and elements present in the volcanic deposits. The landscape is a striking contrast of colors and textures, with the bright yellows of sulfur deposits standing out against the dark, rugged basalt rocks. This dynamic and ever-changing environment is a testament to the powerful geological forces at work beneath the Earth's surface. The air hangs heavy with the scent of sulfur, a constant reminder of the geothermal forces at work. Sulfur vents and fumaroles release gases into the atmosphere, creating a pungent and unmistakable odor. These vents are a visible sign of the intense geothermal activity occurring beneath the surface, where molten rock and gases are constantly being expelled from the Earth's crust. The steam rising from these vents adds to the surreal and otherworldly atmosphere of the region. Geysers erupt, spewing boiling water high into the air, creating a dramatic and awe-inspiring spectacle. These geysers are fueled by the intense heat and pressure from the geothermal activity below, and their eruptions can be both unpredictable and powerful. The sight of boiling water shooting into the sky is a reminder of the raw and untamed forces of nature at play in the Afar Triangle. Bubbling mud pools gurgle ominously, their surfaces shimmering with iridescent hues. These mud pools are created by the interaction of geothermal heat and mineral-rich water, resulting in a thick, bubbling mixture that is both mesmerizing and eerie. The iridescent colors on the surface of the mud pools are caused by the presence of various minerals, creating a captivating and ever-changing display of colors. The Afar Triangle is a land of fire and salt, where the earth seems to breathe, groan, and tremble beneath your feet. This dynamic and volatile region is a living testament to the powerful geological forces that shape our planet. The constant geothermal activity, combined with the extreme heat and arid conditions, creates a unique and challenging environment that is both beautiful and formidable. The Afar Triangle is a place of contrasts and extremes, where the raw power of nature is on full display and the resilience of the human spirit is tested to its limits. In 2005, the Afar Triangle came alive with a dramatic display of geological activity set against its harsh yet breathtaking landscapes. Dabahu, a volcano dormant for centuries, erupted with a force that reverberated through the region. This was not merely a local event, it was a geological spectacle that drew the attention of scientists and observers from around the globe. The eruption sent towering plumes of ash and smoke into the sky, transforming day into night. The once clear blue sky was now filled with dark, swirling clouds of ash, creating an eerie and surreal atmosphere. The earth split open, forming a massive fissure that extended for miles. This fissure was a visible sign of the immense tectonic forces at work, forces that have been shaping our planet for millions of years. Captured by satellite imagery, this dramatic event provided scientists with invaluable data, offering a glimpse into the processes driving continental rifting. The images revealed the scale of the eruption and the extent of the fissure, providing crucial insights into the dynamics of the Earth's crust. The eruption highlighted the Afar Triangle's role as a living laboratory, where the Earth's tectonic plates are actively pulling apart. This region is one of the few places on Earth where such processes can be directly observed, making it a focal point for geological research. 
The 2005 Dabahu eruption was not just a display of nature's raw power. It was a stark reminder of life's vulnerability in the face of such forces. The landscape, once vibrant with life, was now a barren wasteland, a testament to the destructive power of volcanic activity. Yet, even after this volcanic upheaval, life in the Afar Triangle began to re-emerge. Resilient vegetation started to reclaim the land, demonstrating nature's incredible ability to recover and adapt. The Afar people, accustomed to their challenging environment, adapted to the transformed landscape. Their resilience is a testament to the human spirit as they continued their daily lives, finding new ways to thrive in a land dramatically altered by nature. Scientists from around the world flocked to the region, eager to study the aftermath of the eruption. Their research provided new insights into volcanic activity and continental rifting, enhancing our understanding of these powerful natural processes. Educational programs were established to help local communities understand the geological phenomena shaping their land. These programs aimed to equip the Afar people with knowledge to better prepare for future volcanic events. Despite the challenges, life in the Afar Triangle continued. Children played, families gathered, and the community remained strong, a living testament to the resilience and adaptability of the human spirit in the face of nature's formidable power. The Afar Triangle is positioned at the intersection of three tectonic plates, the African, Arabian, and Somali plates, engaged in a slow-motion dance of separation. This phenomenon, known as continental rifting, is gradually tearing the African continent apart, forming a depression that is slowly sinking below sea level. As these plates move apart, magma ascends from the Earth's mantle to fill the gap, creating new crust and driving volcanic activity. The outcome is a landscape in perpetual change, where the Earth's crust is stretched thin and marked by faults and fissures. Over millions of years, this rift valley will continue to expand and deepen. Eventually, seawater from the Red Sea will inundate the Afar Depression, forming a new ocean basin. The emergence of this ocean, a process happening right before our eyes, provides insight into the forces that shaped our planet billions of years ago. The Afar Triangle serves as a window into Earth's ancient past and a predictor of its distant future.